What's up, DA Squad? It's DJ Shanti, and today I'm going to do a. Um, I'm going to show you guys how it was when I had washed my hair. I was about one week post op. As you can see, I have my um, surgical bra on still. My hair it was super dirty, and it's like, ugh, it smelled really bad. <laughs> so I used the Bio Silk shampoo. Then I did um, the rice water treatment. I had added my own ingredients, so that's why it looks a little brown. So it was easier. What well, I, th I thought it might be easier to do it in a sink, and it was. So um, now I'm rinsing my hair, making sure it's wet all over. As you can see, it's kind of hard for me to reach over. Like I was trying to make sure I didn't put no too much pressure on my breast from the sink. I kind of got to use a lot of that shampoo because since my hair is relaxed, it's a little, you know, it don't, that shampoo don't um, have too many suds in it because, you know, it's sulfate free. So that's the best kind of shampoo to use, but to um I, I believe yeah I normally wash my hair twice I shampoo my hair twice so it was a little hard like um shampooing my hair in the sink because my arms was kind of hurting and then I was trying not to put too much pressure from the sink on my breast so now I'm doing the rice water treatment I don't know where I got that mason jar from, but it works. So I just pour the rice, the rice water all over my hair. Um, it's, it's really, it's always cold. I don't know why. It be room temperature, but it's always cold. And then I massage my scalp really good. Make sure I get the back, the middle, the front, the sides. And I make sure I always dip it swish it around play with it or whatever and then after I do that I put it back over my hair I, I do that like three times making sure I get it on my scalp because that's the main thing you need to get get it to with your scalp for some reason the right side of my hair is growing longer than the, the left side I don't know why but I heard that's common so now I'm wringing my hair out, gotta, gotta twist it up, and, and um, I need to get a bag and put it over my head. I normally use two bags when I, um, when I put the bags, when I tie the bags on, I normally have two bags, because it's always dripping down on me, all over my face. So I let that sit for one hour. I got that shirt tied over my neck because it's always dripping down. I'm so glad I found that little uh, that little adapter to the sink. That was so much easier. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. Making sure the water is, the temperature is right before I rinse my hair. So right now I'm, I'm going to be rinsing out the rice water. I really hate how my hair looks when it's wet. I really do. But once I blow dry and flatten it, it looks nice. So you gotta make sure you rinse all of the rice water out your hair. And then after that, I shampoo my hair twice. Cause I like my hair to be moisturized. So I did 
and condition my hair, but I didn't mean can you didn't see it in the clip because I kinda found I always use a towel. I was hearing things like when you use a I said a towel. I use a shirt because I was hearing that when you use a towel, it's not good. I don't know why, but but then I hear that it's okay to use a towel. But I kinda like using this towel because it's easier to wrap my hair around. Look at my hair, y'all. Oh my gosh. Ugh. It's so freaking thick. Gee, so confusion. I say a little bit, but it's, yeah, I guess it is a little bit. Did I have more? Yeah, I did. <laughs> yeah, make sure that's all smooth around. I really hate combing my hair, brushing my hair when it's wet. I cannot stand. Okay, so I got that wide tube comb. And, um, I use a straight guard that help my hair. Um, like when I flat iron it, it helps it get more straight. It's a struggle doing my hair. It takes forever to blow dry my hair, and it's because it's so thick. Now, I need to find something that I can use to blow dry my hair to make it, um, to make the blow drying process a lot quicker, because I know there's some products out there that um, I can use, but I gotta figure out what's the best one. Y'all see Jamari back there just playing. <laughs> Just playing. We actually in his grandma room. You know, Cause you know they was helping me out while I was while I had my surgery. But it looked like I was doing a lot of stuff that I thought I wasn't gonna be able to do. Like I'm a week post, you know, and I'm below, I'm washing my hair, doing the rinse, the rice water rinse. I put conditioner in my hair. I'm, I'm blow drying my hair. Like, I didn't even think I could do that. Look at my baby hair in the back. His hair is so long. I need to braid his hair again. He always got to be next to me. Jamari, look up. Look up. Look at the camera. <coughs> Cheese. Cheese. Hi. Oh. That's my baby. So this is the Bioonic um, flat iron. I freaking love. <laughs> I love this flat iron. I do. Like I say, you only need one pass. You can see on the flat iron say one pass. But I, I always do like two or three. Just because, I don't know, maybe just because my hair thick. But I would be straight just using one pass. I'm a, that, That's what I'm going to try to start doing. Just do one pass. Because that's all I really need. I'll be so extra with it. But I do put heat protectant in my hair. I don't know if you guys saw that. But I use heat protectant. I don't like the one I had. Because it made my hair extra oily. Like So it was like real stiff. Yeah, so now I am looking for a different um, heat protectant, though. If you guys know any good heat protectant, let me know. Put it in the comments. But looking at this video, like, my hair got a lot longer than what it is in this video. So this, this is about... I don't know. This is, like, almost three months since I was one week post-op. So it was almost three months and my hair grew a lot since this video. That's good. I was so tired of doing it. Like, I, I just wanted to give up. <laughs> what the? <laughs> okay, so I'm going to do my hair. 
Okay, so this is the final look. Yeah, my hair is like, yeah. It's oily. Most likely I'm gonna be putting in a ponytail because I don't like wearing my hair down. Mm -mm. Final look, guys. You know what? I'm about to just put it in place right now. My hair did get a lot longer. <clears throat> but I did notice that my breast did feel a little more, a little more sore than it was before. And I guess it was from just lifting my arms and stuff through blow drying and flat ironing in my hair. But it's not as painful to where I need to take a pill or something like that. But um, for the most part, it, I, it was pretty, um, for the most part, it was okay. I mean, like I said, it was just a little more sore than than how it was before I started. Um, but if you like this video, please press the like button and subscribe to my channel if you're new. And I will see you on the next video.